For a while now, we've been following our friends as they explore important words from the Bible. Words that show us how to follow Jesus better. Today, we're going to learn about the word wisdom with our friends Charlotte and Keisha and their friend, Mr. John. Let's watch and learn with them. Charlotte, are you okay? You look kind of sad. It's about the spelling test we had today. What happened? Well, we switched papers to grade them, and Angelica got mine. Oh, I am so sorry. She can be really mean. She was. She held my paper up and pointed to all the words that I got wrong. The teacher stopped her, but a lot of people laughed. I am so sorry, Charlotte. I'm trying to figure out how to not have this ever happen again. Could you study and practice more? No, that takes a lot of work. I think that I need to figure out how to sneak the list of words in so that I can get them all right. Charlotte, that would be cheating. I don't think your parents or the teacher or even Jesus would want that. And besides, you could get caught. Well, I don't think that Jesus would want me to be laughed at either. So maybe he would understand. I'm not so sure. Hey, do you remember how in Sunday school we were talking about the fact that God gives some people this thing called wisdom so that they can help people make good decisions? Maybe we could find someone with wisdom to help us. Hmm. What about Mr. John? He's helped us before, so maybe he has some wisdom. Okay, let's do it. Hi guys, how are you both today? Well, Mr. John, we needed to find a person with wisdom and we thought of you. Oh my, that's very nice of you to think I have wisdom. It's a big job, but I will do my best then to be wise. What's the problem? Well, Mr. John, I didn't do well on my spelling test, and Angelica showed it to the whole class, and they laughed, and that made me feel sad. I think that if that happened to me, I would be sad too. What's the question? So I decided the way not to make it happen again is to ch cheat. I could write the words on my hand or sneak a list in it, and hide it in my desk or something. Do you have any wise ideas on how to cheat? Wow, I know that it always hurts when people laugh at you, but I'm quite sure that cheating is not the answer. You might get away with it once or twice, but you would be eventually caught, and then everyone would be disappointed in you. Even Jesus? Yes, even Jesus. So I can't do anything? Actually, there are some things you can do. You could spend more time practicing your words with your parents. Or with me. Or with Keisha. And you could ask your teacher not to give your test to Angelica again. I think that she would understand. So the wise thing is no cheating and just work harder? Yes, that would be the wise thing to do. It is using the gifts God has given you to work hard and make good decisions. Thanks, Mr. John. We're, We're glad that you shared your wisdom with us because we knew deep down inside that cheating was not right. Both Keisha and Mr. John are wise friends for Charlotte, not because they are smart or because they know a lot, because they shared God's wisdom with her and helped her know what God and Jesus would want her to do.